Now, moving on to our next category, it is the health category, and this award recognizes an individual, a group, or an organization that has made a significant contribution toward healthy living in Bakersfield through education, prevention, and medical services. Here are the nominees. The Alzheimer's Disease Association of Kern County Incorporated. This organization offers various support groups along with adult day care and respite care to ensure Alzheimer's patients and their caregivers live a life of independence and dignity. Christopher Hamilton, MD at Southern California Orthopedic Institute. Dr. Hamilton donates his time treating sports-related injuries free of charge to student athletes. He provides sports medicine coverage on the sidelines at high school football games and has made significant contributions to several local athletic departments. Foundation for Movement, Inc. Move to Improve at Total Woman Fitness provides low-cost, low-impact, and low-intensity exercise programming an encouraging environment for people with physical limitations to help their improve their strength, mobility, and reach their fitness goals. Juvenile Diabetes Research Foundation Central Valley. JDRF is dedicated to supporting, mentoring, and providing support groups for children and families who are diagnosed with both type 1 and type 2 diabetes. Nirav C. Naik, MD, at New Life Weight Loss and Lifestyle Solutions empowers patients to take control of their overall health by providing free nutritional seminars at the Community Health Fair at the Kern County Fair and the Health and Wellness Expo. One Legacy, this organization promotes organ, tissue, and cornea donation awareness at schools, hospitals, and community events. Last year, 25 organ donors transplanted 79 life-saving organs from heroes in the Kern County area. Sensei Scott Milam, or Milam of Golden Tiger Karate. With a belief that healthy starts, or healthy living starts at a young age, Sensei Milam offers a variety of classes so that every student, regardless of age or ability, has the opportunity to learn martial arts. The AIS Cancer Center at San Joaquin Community Hospital. This comprehensive outpatient cancer center not only participated in numerous community projects, but held events to raise awareness, offer education, celebrate cancer survivors, and provide screenings to improve the community's understanding of cancer. Tele Health Docs Medical Group. This local business allows patients to connect with physicians for specialized and quality medical care via a secure technology platform that utilizes video conferencing instead of making a trip to a doctor's office. The sponsor of this award is the Vascular and Leg Center, and the presenter is Dr. Emil Gupta. Please welcome him. Thank you, guys. On behalf of Dr. Vinod Kumar and all the staff at the Vascular and Leg Center, we want to thank all of these nominees for giving us such a beautiful Bakersfield to live in and be proud of. Please give them a round of applause. You know, we feel really fortunate to belong to this medical community because uh, I remember there were times when we had to go to Santa Barbara for specialist medical care and that doesn't happen anymore. So our health community has really contributed in a big way. And today we want to congratulate one such um, healthcare organization or individual. Dr. Kumar always tells me, Pehla um, Sukh Nirogi Kaya, this is a Hindi motto, which means the first blessing in life is a positive health. And so the organization that has best exemplified this motto is Alzheimer's Disease Association of Kern County. Congratulations. The Alzheimer's Disease Association of Kern County is simply all about families helping families. ADAKC offers respite care to ensure Alzheimer's patients and their caregivers live a life of independence and dignity. Some of the daily social activities at ADAKC include dancing, singing, piano playing, pet therapy, and even baseball. During 2015, ADAKC provided more than 69,000 hours of service in its adult daycare to seniors and disabled adults with Alzheimer's or other forms of dementia. 
This would not be possible without 500 volunteers who help to provide services such as caregiver education, support groups, clerical functions, fundraising efforts, and trainings. The organization outgrew its current location, so in October, ADAKC broke ground on a new facility that will allow it to triple the number of individuals it serves. Last November, ADAKC spread Alzheimer's awareness with its campaign, The Heart Never Forgets, and received more than 600 new inquiries before the end of the year. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you so much. We have such an amazing community, and for so long, so many people did not want to speak about Alzheimer's. There's no cure. It's not fun. We at ADAKC are turning something so negative into something so positive. These amazing people back here who run the show every day, it can't go on without them. Kate UC, our CEO, has been running it for almost 10 years, and they're amazing. If you've never been out to ADAKC, please come check it out. If you've never been touched by Alzheimer's, you are so blessed. This room is filled with so many people from our community, and I'm so proud to be here. I just have one favor. If the next week you can go out and ask a couple people that you know, friends or family, if they've ever heard of ADAKC, just to spread the word, to help us. It's so much easier for us to bring it up than somebody to come talk about Alzheimer's because it's such a scary disease. Nobody wants to talk about Alzheimer's or dementia. So please help us spread the word. We're here for you. You're not alone on this journey. And thank you to everyone back here. Thank you to this community for supporting us. We're the only uh, nonprofit local social atmosphere for our loved ones on the Alzheimer's journey. And we're doing big things in the community. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.